This is for Aquarius Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus placement on their chart. Jupiter may also resonate with the reading. Cross watchers are always welcome. So cross watchers, if I describe someone here and you know that it is not you, then it is not you. Okay, for those of you who is new to the channel, you might want to consider subscribing for I am always hosting a party online wherein I am doing a live streaming. And on the live stream, you can ask me questions. Okay? And... Aquarius, if you want to join the live streaming, patience is needed because I am answering questions randomly. So, patience is really needed. If you missed the live streaming, you can still ask me questions. There's a link in the description box. Click that link, you'll be routed to my page. Tap in your question and then you click submit. Okay, so Capricorn. If you also want to know your lucky number and lucky color, follow me on Instagram. There's a link in the description box. 500 likes for this video. We will open the mystery cards here. Um, and if you want your pictures to be posted or included in our thumbnails, send me your DMs. There's a link in the description box. If you resonate with the reading, congratulations. If you do not resonate with the reading, come back to the reading after we go to time is through it. If you resonate with some bits and pieces of the reading, then still congratulations for I am doing a collective reading. So Cap I mean Aquarius, Capricorn, Aquarius, let's begin with the reading. This is your first card, three of pentacles, um, and seven of wands. It feels like you're trying to fix something, right? You're fixing something, but instead of fixing something, people around you is, I mean, you're getting all the blame. That's what I'm seeing. So you're trying to figure out or there's something here that you did, right? Uh, by mistake, it's not intentional. Well, everybody can make mistake though, right? But you got the blame. But it feels like this is a team effort. This is a team effort, but you took all the blame. Um, they're blaming you for this. Um, let's say you are in this connection. You are, let's say, connecting with someone, but you know, you did it. Um, you did something, but you know that this is for the, for the benefit of your connection. Yes, it failed, but why is it that you took why is it that they're blaming you, right? Um, I think that they know this. And they're a part of it. Queen of Wands. I think you need to speak up. You need to say something. Um, oh, there you go. You cannot, you cannot speak to the person. Because the person already turned their back on this. I can see disagreement. I can see the person is not talking. Um, intentionally, they do not want to talk to you. Right. As I can see here, five of wands, they placed you in a competition. Or you place someone in a competition. It could also be you. Cross watchers, if you feel like this is your reading, so be it. And Aquarius, if you feel like you are on the cross watcher's side, well, that is okay. I'm not reading which side you're at. I am reading the energy. But as I can see, someone placed the other person in a competition. So someone's just waiting, waiting for the ship to come in, waiting for their chance to speak up, waiting for the synchronicities of the universe, waiting for the right time. Um, they cannot let go of this dynamic. Um, that's true. They feel that they are tied into this dynamic. They want to clean this up. Um, there's a lot of cleaning. There's a lot of fixing to do, but they can't because the other person is not helping them. The other person is not kind of like giving them the chance to redeem their self, themselves. Um, as I can see here, it was also placed intentionally. And so there are, I can see that for a small percentage of you, you've been hexed here. 
all right um you're working hard you're working hard in this connection um you want this connection to move to another level and that is for sure you might be connecting with a Taurus or has a Taurus placement on their chart or you have a Taurus placement on your chart but what you just want is this connection come to fruition and now because you got the blame they got you confused so which trick should I pull now right it feels like you made me think that you made me think that I I miss this connection but in reality it's both of you it takes two to tango but they, they, they just want you to take the blame right they want to clean their hands um, but that's why they also turn your back in this connection <coughs> three of Pentacles I want to know this nine of cups I mean eight of cups three of Pentacles is here is actually a repeat card this is a this is their strategy so that they will not they're not talking for cups they're ignoring you because they don't want to take the play well you might be placed in a connection so I can also see here that some um, I can also hear that the other person say the reason why I um, the, the reason why I choose other person is because you're this yada yada King of, I mean, King of Pentacles. They're giving you all of this um, blames, but what you want is to give them the abundance, right? Four of Pentacles is actually here. They're holding back. They're holding back, right? They're kind of like saving themselves from any. They said they are saving themselves. They're saving themselves from any chaos. So they put you there on this, right? five of wands showed up you are really in a competition but a promise that you're gonna get your abundance you're working hard here so Aquarius this is your reading if you resonate with this and you want to go in depth you can contact me and if you have a question with this reading there's a link in the description box click that link you'll be routed to my page tap in your question then you click submit if you want your picture to be um, associated with the thumbnails, send us your DMs. Click the subscribe button and smash that notification bell. Comment down below. Share the video if you will. Thank you so much for watching. Love and light to you. Namaste. See you in the next reading. Goodbye.